Let's take a look at this question now. An equipment hire company, Alpha, hires out diggers. For the use of a digger, Alpha charges $80 for each of the first seven days plus $50 per day for each extra day. Find the higher charge for 11 days. Okay, for 11 days, there's no big deal. So what you're going to do, you're going to say 7 days times 80. That's the first 7 days, which is then $560. And then you've got um, for 11 days. So 11 minus 7 is 4. So you get plus 4 times $50, which is then $200. So you add these two, you should be able to get $760. That's the answer to the first part of the question. Second part, find the number of days for which the charge is $1,010. Okay, now the charge is $1,010. So I got 7 times 80 plus the number of extra days. So N multiplied by 50 because for each extra day you're going you're gonna to charge you $50 and you get the total charge as 1010 So this is 560. I've got 560 plus 50N. Is equal to 1010 solving this you're going to get n is equal to 1010 okay minus the 560 and then all of that divided by 50 so 1010 okay minus uh, 560 divided by 50 you're going to get nine so nine days is the number of extra days so the total number of days is then the seven days that it was taken plus the extra number of days nine so that makes it 16 days for which the digger was hired in the second part of the question there's another company called beta and beta also hires diggers and beta charges 70 dollars for each day that a digger is hired when a digger is hired for x days beta charges 250 dollars more than alpha Given that x is greater than 7, write down an expression in x for the number of dollars charged for x days by alpha. So if we go back to alpha, so this is part B now, and part B, uh, first part A, all right, we want to go to alpha. How much alpha is going to charge? Now remember, x is greater than 7 days. So... There is, um, for the first seven days, they're going to charge you seven times 80. Then for the extra number of days, you're going to get X minus seven times 50. So the total charge by alpha is 560. Okay, so 560. 50 times X is 50X plus 50x minus 350 because 50 times 7 is 350 so 560 take away um, 350 210 so the charge by alpha is going to be equal to um, 50x all right mm plus 210 so here we are done now beta so remember beta is charging $70 for each day that the digger is hired okay so then I've got beta so part B we want to find out how much beta is going to charge beta is going to charge 70 times X number of days which is 70 X dollars all right so this is alpha and this is beta remember now that again we are told that beta is charging $250 more than alpha when it was hired for X number of days so if beta is charging $250 more than alpha we need to add 250 to alpha to make it equal to beta so alpha plus 250 will equal to beta this is part b uh, second part eh? b second part 
So what was the charge by alpha for x number of days? It was 50x plus 210. Then plus the 250. Then all of that should be equal to beta, 70x. The 50x can go on the other side. It becomes 70 minus 50. I mean, of course, x with it. And these two add up together is going to be equal to 460. So we want to find x. We got then 20x is equal to 460. So x is equal to 460 divided by 20. So it should be 23, I suppose. Yeah, 23 days. So that means x is equal to 23. And here we are. Now, last part of the question. Check your value of x by calculating the charge. You need to calculate the charge made by each company. All right, let's go for alpha. Now, if we go for alpha, this part C of the question, how much alpha is going to charge for x number of days, which is 23 days? Remember, it's going to be 7 times 80 always. That's the first 7 days. Then for the extra number of days, it was 23 minus 7, which is 16. So you're going to get 16 times um, 50. Because for each extra number of days, each extra day, it's 50. All right, so let's do that in a calculator. So I've got 560 plus, this is 560 plus 16 times 50. So alpha is charging $1,360. So therefore, $1,360. That's from alpha. What about beta? We need to calculate the charge for each company. So beta is charging $70 per day. So for 23 days, I'm going to get 23 times 70. If I work it out here, 70 times 23. It's going to give me 1610 so 1610 obviously we see that beta is charging more 1610 here All right pardon me for my handwriting it's 1610 let us see if this value of x is okay all right and whether or not that beta is charging 250 dollars more than alpha if we do that we're going to take 1610 take away 1360 let us see 1360 wow here we are it checks out 250 more you see there we go that's your answer all right so it checks out Here we are. We were told to check our value of x by calculating the charge made by each company. And here we are. Question is nicely done. Take care.